Well, hello there, everyone. It is your lovely host with the most right flipping here. It is Team Rai Rai. How is everyone doing on this Tuesday's edition? I'm doing very well so far. I have TikTok, Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, and my own Facebook page. So check them out, follow me, subscribe, and I'll I hopefully do believe. Now it is time to discuss wrestling news, wrestling topics, and a lot of awesome information to discuss for you. Now if you like, sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, grab some drink. Now if you don't do like that, maybe you want to like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions on this subject. And of course, the article will be down below or the link will be down below. For this one, there will be a link. There's an article plus there's a video down below. Let's begin here. Now, what are your thoughts on Nature Boy, Nature Boy Ric Flair's current status with the WWE? He's with, um, he's teamed up with Randy Orton. I guess he's managing Randy Orton. So, a lot of you are complaining because due to the virus, he should have stayed home. I agree. And, speaking of Ric Flair, I guess he picked up medicine for his wife or food, and he didn't wear no mask in the drive through And I said to myself, What's the big deal? It's the um, it's in the vehicle. You're not going in the restaurant, but I know a lot of you are upset what I'm trying to say. Um, yeah, Ric Flair. He is a freaking legend. I met him once. I was very nervous, so um, I was not a big fan of him. But it was kind of neat to meet him. You know, he's very friendly. He was not rude to any of the fans. I mean, that's what I saw. A lot of these W superstars are very rude. They just care about one thing is making money and that's it. A lot of them don't even do autograph sessions. How stupid. Like Brock Lesnar. He don't do autograph sessions. Probably thinks he's too big to um, give to the fans, you know? But whatever. Okay. I don't know how long are we going to see um, Ric Flair on TV. You know, they recently signed a brand new contract with him and the WWE. So probably he's going to stay with WWE until he's done, you know. So you guys, I'm not going to even discuss this article. I'm not going to even discuss it, but the video, you guys could check it for yourself. You know, I'm, I'm kind of glad that he's teamed up with Orton. You know, he's like managing, you know, because he can't wrestle more. He's too flipping old, you know. So if he can't wrestle... The next best thing for Ric Flair is to manage. I don't know if he's good. I don't pay attention if he gets involved in matches. Most likely, Randy Orton will beat Drew McIntyre at SummerSlam. And then probably Drew McIntyre will get his second reign at the title. But this time, will be a lot of fans cheering for him or booing him, you know? I just... I, I, I felt sorry for Drew McIntyre when he won the belt at Mania and there was nobody in the audience. To feed into the crowd. So I felt so bad for these wrestlers. Now they got fans. Well, technically they're not fans. They're workers. But some of them are fans. So I don't want to believe anymore. So I don't know when we're going to have a full capacity. For fans. Probably not until 2021 or 2022. I know it's a long way from now. But it's a long, long process. You know. Can you imagine January 20. 2021, the Royal Rumble will still be at the Performance Center. People will be pissed. You know, it will never be the same. So, it's just a hiccup in the road. Hopefully, they all fix this mumbo jumbo. Not mumbo jumbo, but you guys get the drift. And the other thing is, what's your thoughts about Raw? I think Underground Raw is like a ripoff of version of Brawl for Raw back in the day. So, whatever. And I guarantee that. Shane O'Mac will lead his pack and destroy Raw and SmackDown. That will be his version of the angle. I mean, invasion. I could be right. I could be wrong. So, whatever. And what's your thoughts on MVP, Bobby Lashley, and Benjamin's stable name? You like it? Dislike it? At the end of the show, it's okay. Something different. Brand new stable. It won't last forever. They will break up. W will destroy him. Because the house of, that's how W does. Especially McMahon. He's a dumbass. 
everyone out there have a good one and i'll see you guys tonight for video number two later